Today we'll be taking an early look sample at the latest product from Devoom. This is the Pixu Max. This is a customizable pixel art signboard, and it's a little bit different from previous releases. So I purchased the TiVo and the Ditto here, and these are great little portable Bluetooth speakers. However, this does not have a built-in speaker, so it's a little bit different. It focuses mainly on pixel art creation, mood lighting, music visualization. Uh, it's got a multi-use purpose for in-car display, and actually came with a couple of unique little accessories. So we've got two suction cups here. You can screw into the built-in threads on the top and the bottom here, and then you can have this displaying inside your car window, your back windshield, things like that. So you can communicate to other people on the road, or you know, say you're an Uber or a Lyft driver, and you, you just wanna have the Uber or the Lyft logo showing on there, you can easily do that. Also comes with a very lengthy uh, cigarette adapter so you can get some power so you plug this into the cigarette lighter adapter in your car and then it has this in for power you plug this device in there and then you've got two usb ports and then you could plug in the included usb-c charging cable that way you have always have power however you don't have to plug this in to utilize it in the car it's completely internal battery powered. The internal battery lasts about five to six hours is what I've experienced while testing this out. So plenty of time, but very simple, very sleek design. It is seven inches across and seven inches tall, so perfectly square. On the bottom and the top, we've got the thread for the suction cup. It has a little detachable stand here. Just shoves in right there. Works as a little kickstand, that way it can prop itself up. Or, if you wanted to, you could utilize this just as some hanging display. It's got even a little hanging there. And again, since it's seven by seven, you don't have to worry about not having a hanger up on this side. It's going to be the exact same dimension regardless. So you can hang it on the wall if you like. Again, USB-C charge port is there. Built-in microphones on the back, that way it can pick up the audio and then on the side we have the power and the function button so that is all we have so the function we go through the built-in menus it's got a couple of little predetermined settings here that just show little various different pixel art animations these are some that i've downloaded onto it from the dvoom app very easy very simple to do all i have to do is open up the app and then you can scroll through tons and tons of tons of community made artwork. You can create your own. There's all sorts of things on here. Anything you can really think of, all you have to do is simply search it and you'll be able to find it. Let's see, so let's just type in Uber. Let's see if, see if we can find an Uber logo. Surely there's an Uber logo, right? And bada bing, we got various options for the Uber logo. We can have scrolling text, we can got animations, we have stagnant text, so. That works out really easy. And there's also great functionality for voice commands. So you can go to this discover on your app, go to voice commands, and then you can set it to do various different things with your phone. So you can have it showing specific images. So say you wanted a frowny face emoji for somebody that you know was tailgating you or something, you would type in your voice command and say, you know, angry or something like that into your phone and then it would show the angry face on the screen and then whoever's behind you would see that upset face and you could actually obviously go even further down that rabbit hole and have text that says get off my get off my back or you're tailgating or anything like that, you know. The the world is your oyster. You could be as, you know, mean or as nice as you possibly want to be as far as communicating with other drivers. But overall, I got to say this thing is very impressive. It also came in the box with some Devoom stickers. These come with all the Devoom products I've ever picked up and purchased. Uh, typically you would stick them on the sides and things like that. Since this is such a thin little profile design, I'm not really gonna utilize these stickers, but it's nice that they include it because it kind of shows you their origin or where they come from with the whole pixel art background and their you know, expertise, so to speak. But let me know in the comments down below what you guys think of this product. Is it something you'd be interested in, even if it's just for the, you know, the pixel art, or is this something you could actually see yourself using in, in the car or inside a shop window? Let me know in the comments down below your thoughts. That's all we have for today's video. I hope you enjoyed the content. If you did, make sure you hit that like button, share this video with your friends, and as always, thanks for watching, guys. It really means a lot.